Unit 86. George is absent-minded. Pauline, have you seen Debbie? I was with her a minute ago. No, George, I haven't seen her since the coffee break. I've just seen her. I need her to write a letter for me. Have you looked in reception? Yes, I've just been there. Oh, but it's 5 to 12 already. In five minutes, she'll be having lunch. Do you know where she normally goes for lunch? Yes, she always has lunch in the steakhouse at the corner. I'm going there. I know that restaurant. I haven't been there for a long time. I'm hungry. Do you want to come? Oh, why not? I haven't been there for a couple of months either. But we can only eat meat there. Well, I would just love a big red sirloin. That's exactly what my body needs today. Oh, you are like me. My body tells me what it needs every day. Uh, we appear to have sensitive bodies. Since I've become more aware of my body's needs, I feel so much better. And what does your body say today? Let me listen. Yes, a uh, filet mignon with vegetables, a glass of red wine, and an espresso coffee. Oh, and a nice man to talk to. Okay, let's go then. Hey, maybe you can help me with this letter instead of Debbie. Probably, George, but I'll ask my buddy about it after lunch, okay? Hey, I didn't know we had such a wonderful girl in the office. Well, George, I've always thought that you were a bit short-sighted. Of course, how silly of me. Well, I'm gonna do something about it from now on. You'll see.